Hi folks, so we've just arrived at a lovely lake just outside Dramara. This is Begney Lake and uh, we had to come down a couple of nights ago to pick up a swan which had crash landed in a field. Um, it came down in the field, quite a, quite a tumble so fell out of the sky as being described as. Um, so we presume that it's probably clipped the nearby sort of telephone lines or car lines and just lost momentum. I'm really glad to say, like, thankfully it didn't injure itself. Um, so we're going to release it. We've come down to the lake here just to find out where it's come from and uh, came to this first access point and it was lovely to see there's a male and the female is sitting up there and it's hard to see because my phone won't zoom in any further but just about Oh, let me see if I can poke the bird heads. Um, where are we? We're just about up there. There's a whole crowd of baby cygnets. Oh, there's a big heron walking along as well. <laughs> um, so we know that this particular swan I have isn't obviously part of this family. So we're not going to release it at this end of the lock, um, on the lake, sorry. There is another group of swans at the other end. So we're going to head up there now and see if we can get some access and get this chappy back to the water again. So, actually come up to the far end of the lake there, um, the fields along the sort of roadside there all have sheep in it. It's good livestock, so we don't want to be disturbing any of that. Um, I've got one wee field here, and there is a swan sitting in it on its own, which is great. Um, I'd really like to take this guy down to the water, so I'm going to go and see if I can get hold of him now. Folks, this is our swan. And, uh, yes, I know, yes, we're going to get you now. So as you can see, he's ready to go. Thankfully, he didn't suffer any injuries, no wing problems, anything. He's just come down and lost momentum and got stuck in the dark. And uh, so a wee bit of a rest and he's absolutely fine. So we'll get him out here and we'll get over this gate. Yes, I know you want to go back. You know you're home, don't you? So we'll get this guy out and let's get him away. So we've managed to get over the gate. Tying said swan. And going to be a bit awkward video in this one hand, but here we go. Um, so I'm going to take them down. I always like to kind of see them actually getting on the water rather than dropping them at the top and having them walk down. And um, they've had enough stress with sort of crashing into the wires and stuff and then being in captivity and then being carried. So um, just one less thing for them to have to do. So you can see lovely lake here. View, but you can see lovely lake here and the swan that's sitting in the field is now just swimming off in the water there don't know if that's this one's made but there is quite a few other swans here so which i'm glad to see right off you go Whee! it's also a brilliant sound here in the running on the water Um, whenever he actually came down in the field, so I think it's crossed. Nice day to finish up. 